Matt Porter's here from Matt Porter Web Design, our gadget guru. You can find him at Innovation Marshall at Astral Park. Uh, good morning. I good think morning. I've chosen the wrong day uh, to go to Felixstowe this week uh, because uh, we, we got a tad wet yesterday. Yes, I saw that. Yes, yeah. yes in Felixstowe. Uh, the forecast for today, uh, still very nice, I understand, at Felixstowe at the moment. Well, we were there Friday, actually. Yeah, we, yeah. Stayed over at f- we stayed over there. I saw on your Facebook page. And it was, page, it was yeah. like being on the continent. Yeah, it was beautiful. Yeah. Uh, It will be a fine morning across the area, says the forecast, which has just come in. A fine morning across the area with good spells of sunshine. However, conditions will deteriorate this afternoon as it becomes breezier with cloud and rain spreading in from the southwest, which will be heavy at times. Maximum temperature today, 19 Celsius, 66 Fahrenheit. Um, Yeah, at the moment there's sunny intervals around pretty much everywhere, I think, so. Yes. Typical. Typical. Changeable. But thank you if you came along and wound the window down and said, Hi, how are you? Wound the window up and drove off again, which was great to see on several <laughs> occasions. Uh, so this week, um, Matt's here every week, and uh, he reviews all sorts of gadgets. And this week we have a phone. This is the LG G4 mobile phone, which is um, got a phablet size. It's, it's, it's bigger than a normal phone. Uh, oh, my goodness me. Uh, look at that. Look at that. Wow, picture quality. That's stunning. Yes. We're looking at a video on the phone at the moment. Yeah, it's... Um, wow! LG... Um, that's Machu Picchu. It is. That's exactly where it is, yeah. LG um, are kind of have set a bar, really, on the quality of the screens on their phones. It's so better than my telly. It is, yeah. It's actually what's called Ultra HD, so it's... Or, or um, um, it's basically 2560 pixels instead of 1920, so it's 2K, I think they call it. So it's not quite 4K, but it's 2K. The quality is amazing. I think it's something in the region of 540 um, pixels per inch. So normal printed page is about 300, so it's it's very, very high quality. Um, it, it comes with a, a very nice camera as well. It comes with a 16 megapixel camera, um, which has um, a laser focus on it. Um, LG did this in their last model of phones. It's got a little laser that's built into the back of the phone, so it focuses very quickly on whatever you point it at. Um, it's 16 megapixels, f1.8. We were talking about f stops last week yes, when we were talking about phones, and, uh, phones, and the, the phone, the camera I had last week was f1.8. That uh, lens on that is also f1.8. So the picture quality on this is probably as good as a, a point and shoot. Possibly, it is the the f1.8 is really an amount amount of light that the the lens allow or the lens the sensor allows in when you take a picture. So it's excellent for low light photographs, very sharp. Um, again, not quite there with the point and shoot because mm. obviously there's more technology okay. crammed inside but not far those away, then. not far off no They're, it's an excellent excellent camera it's got a good camera on the front as well because the thing is when you're taking pictures with your phone but they look fine on your phone but when you blow them up they're yeah. often a bit blurry and yeah. they're not quite right are they so on that though you'll be able to tell because it's such a high resolution screen so yeah. even if you know you're right when you look at it on your phone you think oh that looks great and yeah. when you get back and actually look at it on a full screen you think okay it's not, it's not quite as yeah. nice um it has a hexacore processor we always talk about these different processors so dual core quad core we had octo core a couple of weeks ago so like a bond villain i oh, know this is hexacore which i believe is six processors basically when they talk about dual core it's about a, f- a physical microprocessor with but it has two um built onto it so this hexacore actually has f- six cores so six processors running within uh, one piece of silicon which is very clever um it's got a plastic case on it which means you can pop the back off and you can change it uh, there's leather cases and things like that for it um i think it's got a slight curve as well to mm. the entire phone yeah so it's very very um small but apparently there's a slight curve there which uh which apparently um is what people want <laughs> okay the only thing you know i've got reasonably big hands but yeah. again for me this is just not comfortable it, interestingly enough that one has got one of the smallest um sizes so uh, at the edge of the screen you have like a bezel yeah. and on that phone the bezel is is very very small so it actually brings the physical mm. size of the phone down but Yes, it is big. It's a big screen, um, uh, without a doubt. Um, but uh, apparently, that's what 
the punters want now. Okay. They they wanted small screens to start off got with. Bigger hands than I <laughs> they have, yeah. It's quite a nice phone to hold as well. Uh, it doesn't slide out of your hand. It's quite nice. So. Um, it, yeah, it's a, it's a lovely phone. 32 meg of memory in it and three meg... Uh, sorry, th- 32 gig of memory mm. and three gigabytes of um, storage for what, using the operating system. So, so really, if really you're fast. buying a phone now, this is the LG G4 mobile phone. If you're buying a phone now, um, perhaps sit down and, and write a list of the things that you want to use it for Yeah, and uh, and then work out which is going to be the best one for you. That's right, because, you know, screen sizes, they're all large, and uh, well, not all large, but they, they can be quite large. This is 5.5 inches. Um, there's larger, there's 5.7 inches and 6 and all those kind of things. But, yeah, you've got a choice here, really, of, uh, uh, of, of what you're looking for with your phone, and it comes down to your personal preferences, but also the cost per month um, that something like this will, 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 it will mm. you know, will cost, you know, f- uh, on contract, because obviously the more expensive the phone, the larger the contract's going to be. Um, and these are, um, you know, you can shop around as well. These are pretty good. Yeah. Um, there you go. Really, that's, that's it. Good. That's great. Um, I, I can't get over the picture quality, which is which is amazing. Really, I it mean, is, it is fantastic. Simply yeah. stunning, and yeah, it is better got... than my. It is better than my TV at home. It is. It will be, yeah. Your yeah. TV at home, unless it's a 4K TV, is going to yeah. be 1080 uh, 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 HD, whereas this is, um, um, I think, 2560. OK, if you want to find out more about this, it's the LG G4 mobile phone. Uh, go to thegadgetman.org.uk, yeah. thegadgetman.org.uk, yeah. for more on this and all the other gadgets that Matt reviews. And if there's uh, something you want us to uh, look at, a particular thing on the show, uh, then get in touch, and we might be able to do that uh, one of these uh, weeks. Uh, good to see you. Thank you very much. Thank you very Cheers. much indeed. And it's thegadgetman.org.uk. That's Matt Porter from Matt Porter Web Design at Innovation Martlesham on Ad Astral Park.